Oh, sorry about that. Still trying to figure out what it takes to make it on YouTube. Hey, this is Jeannie Lynch. Thanks for clicking in. This is the video that I've been waiting to post and it's all about setting you up to succeed for our first class. We're coming back together April 1st for Spiritual Modalities for a Spiritual Life. So stay watching. I'm going to tell you what you need to know prior to coming to this class and what questions I'll be asking in class and what you need to do prior to coming. Are you ready? Let's dive in together today to do the work. Stay watching. Hey everybody, it's Jeannie and guess what? It's that time of year again where we reconvene and recreate our beautiful tribe. And I will announce that our tribe is absolutely expanding. We're up to 40 on Facebook, close to 400 on YouTube, and I think there's 15 people joining our class. So this video is the video that you need to watch prior to coming so that you're organized and ready to go and do the work when you come through the door. My format is similar to past years, so if this is your first year, here's what we do. I put up a video a week or two before, and then a couple days before, the same video will go up. It'll be on our Facebook page, it'll be on my YouTube channel, so if you're following this on YouTube, welcome, okay? It's workshop format, and that means there's always links and things to do. There's questions to be prepared to answer, and it's your journey. So let me just start right there. These classes and these workshops, for anybody taking them, are for you to do the work for self. Yes, we come together as a group and we share our experiences and we support each other, but you're not here to solve the person's next to you's issues or, you know, stand up. That's not even my job. My job is to facilitate you to do the work for yourself. Okay, so this class is gonna be no different, but it is specifically designed with these modalities in mind for your own kind of profiling, for your own understanding of self. Okay, so let me get started. We're gonna also be doing a book club around the side. Isn't that a great idea, Carolyn and Lisa? Thank you for that idea. Um, women who run with the wolves. So we are gonna be called the bone people, and my name for this class is gonna be La Lopa and she is the gatherer. And the woman archetype of the wolves is all about freedom. So it makes sense that here, as we're doing this class, we have this beautiful book to read together behind the scenes. So you can get a hard copy, you can come and I can download it to your iPhone, you can take it on a thumbnail and bring it back to me, you can buy your book yourself, you can get it on Amazon, but you need to have the book on your bookshelf for the next eight months as we go through this class together. So that's the first thing that's different. We have, I think, up to 15 people, let's say 10 to 15, that will be taking this class. This Thursday, I will have that number wrapped up. You will get here on April 1st, 10 minutes, hopefully early, so we can enter circle together and get caught back up. And so, yes, there's some homework you need to do prior to April 1st. Are you ready? We're going to dive right in to the beginning of our course, which is, excuse me, on the Enneagrams. So I'm going to put a link below. It'll also be on Facebook. If you've already taken the test, because I posted this a couple months ago, take it again. I want that energy on you. It's like the chakra test in the sense that it's like 50 questions. I always feel like this, never feel like this, sometimes feel like this. It keeps the profiling going, and you will receive an Enneagram archetype number. You have to bring that number to class. I'm going to use that number to take you through a whole worksheet and you're going to be learning what your wings are, what your stands are. Um, oh, there's so many other aspects of this. How you act in stress, what happens when you feel secure. Okay, so you're going to be learning that in class, so you need to have that number when you come. And then I'm going to send you home with a worksheet and you're going to have to do that process with two other people. Because what I know is, if you're teaching somebody how to do something you're learning, you're learning it. So I love that. So we'll be doing that. So, so far, we've got the book that we're going to be reading together. We have the first test is the Enneagrams. You're also going to be coming with two other answers when we get to circle. And one of them is, what class are you most excited about taking? So if you're watching this on YouTube, comment below. If you're watching it on Facebook, put the answer there or share it in class. 
for those who are following virtually. Um, which one are you most excited about? And then I also want you to rate them on a scale from one to 10. Which, what do you feel you know for knowledge? Is it a two? I know the most about it. I only know a five. I want those numbers so I understand kind of where you are and um, that'll give us a sense of where we can steer the class. As you know, this year I'm doing it. See my gear? I got new gear. I'm gonna be doing interviews, Skype interviews. And if you, if, if you have an idea for a modality that's not on our list, I'm interested. I could do, I did 54 videos last year for the Buddhism. It took off into all these other aspects of Buddhism that I wasn't even aware that were there. I'm looking to do the same for these modalities. I want to put in as much in front of you as I can as your teacher and let you do the work for yourself as involved as you want to be, right? The ones that I have listed will be specifically the ones we will be doing in class. That doesn't mean there won't be bonus videos. Those of you who know me know that. This is Jeannie. I am so excited. I'm so stoked. I'm already learning so much. I can't wait to share my light with you. I can't wait for you to meet the new people involved and the new modalities that we'll be touching and feeling and learning today, this year. Can you tell I'm stoked? I will see you in a couple weeks. Love and light, bone people. You'll know what that means when you read the book. La Lopa saying goodbye.